If you look at the history of uh, communism, there always been political struggles and political movements. Those have always been the tools and vehicles for getting rid of the political rivals and the other factions. But the victims have always been Chinese people or the deplorables. Like in Soviet Union, in Romania, other countries, the same. The, the price always been the deplorables and middle class and people has been working for them. So that's definitely a characteristic for communism. Now, like we see the, the communism is infiltrating United States and United States is becoming more like a communist country. But the good thing is right now, like it's not about one person has a say because in communist China, like she has a say, right? She has already purged everyone. Now, United States is still like a free country that still has the balance of power and still have the people. Now we're seeing more and more people being realizing people are not fools. People just lack of information or knowledge. They're not fools. They're not stupid. Nobody agrees with the communists. Nobody likes communists. They just need the information. And what you guys have been doing are just uh, enlightening all the general public to realize more and more. And I believe in the end, 